From Penn Trafford High School tonight, the Penn Hills Indians in round one of the WPIAL playoffs take on the Penn Trafford Warriors. A very pleasant good evening to you from Harrison City, Pennsylvania, the home of the Penn Trafford Warriors. The Indians come into tonight's contest the fourth seed, uh, fourth out of fourth place out of the Southeastern Conference. Penn Trafford, the runner-up in the quad south or the quad. Uh, Whatever they call it out here. Indians decked out in the road. Whites kicking off. Getting things started. Defense will be out on the field. Marshall Thompson. Nice booming kick down to the 14-yard line. Timothy Vescio on the return. He'll be stopped at the 30-yard line. Coming up with the tackle, Raquan Cooper. And the Indian defense will take the field. Indian defensive front needs a big game tonight as Penn Trafford is a solid running team. Defensive ends Marshall Thompson and Trey Reese tackles on the inside. Mike Ames and Joe Navari, who led the conference in tackles this season with 40 solo tackles. Penn Trafford comes out throwing. Swing pass this way. Featherstone and Reese will come up and make the tackle after a pickup of a yard. Brendan Reddy on the reception. Warriors looking to try to spread out that Indian defense before they start attacking that middle. Teams all season long having trouble running up the gut on the Penn Hills Indians defense. Their defensive line has really been the strong point of the team this season. Bobbled snap. Loose on the field, picked up by the Indian shot. Malik Russell. Malik Russell will pick it up and run it in for the Penn Hills touchdown. Malik Russell looked about 25 yards on the return. And the Indians go up early here, 6 0, just 48 seconds into the game. Thompson will try the point after, and well, it all it has to do is go over. It doesn't have to go over by much. Kick is good. Just like that, it's Penn Hill 7, Penn Trafford nothing. And a good omen. So Thompson will tee it up for the second time tonight. And the Indian defense gets to come out and do it again, hopefully. Thompson's kick taken at the eight. And a nice return on the play by Devin Austin. And the Warriors in decent field position now, but the Indian defense back out onto the field here. Brendan Reddy will pick up about seven yards. Yeah, it'll bring up a second down and three now for PT.
Centennial Sack on the last play was number nine, DeAndre Winbush Chapino. That's number 34, Tucker Stinelli, Tommy inside. Tommy Stinelli gets down into Pendles territory to the 44-yard line. 28, Cody Allen, and 41, Dion Douglas. Come on in the top. It's a pickup of 10 for the Warriors, their first first down. Stinelli and Reddy in the eye. And it'll be Stinelli again. Stinelli finally brought down by Cody Allen, not until he picks up a first down, about another 10 yards. Brett LaFoon, your quarterback for the Penn Trafford Warriors. A lot of these kids familiar with each other as they played uh, Penn Trafford and Penn Hills and Midgets. Stinelli again, looks for somewhere to go. Reese will wrap him up, and Thompson brings him down with the help of Joe Navari. Inside the 30 to the 29. Gets three for the PD. Three yards on the carry. Marshall Thompson, number five, the Indian stopper. Second down and seven. Clock approaching 9-10 and running here in the opening period. The Indian is up 7-0. Ready. Quick hitter up the middle for a couple. Maybe about three yards. Going to set up a third down and a long two for PT. Fifty-seven, Cameron Richardson. Oh, third and three here for the Warriors. Indian tacklers. Stinelli cuts it back up and in. A penalty flag will come in. Stinelli knights his way inside the 25 to 22 for an apparent PT first up. We do have a flag on the play. Joe Kulik, the official, will mark off the, will make out the penalty. That'll put a damper on the Warriors' drive. Set to be third down and 13 for And they get a third and 13 after the 10 yard mark off. on that last play with 59 Joe Navari and 50 Jerome Brown. And he's coming on the blitz, so the pressure pass complete. DeAndre Shafino with the tackle after pickup of about eight, but it'll bring up a fourth down. Shafino was hot in pursuit, did not let him get the first down sticks. Gave up a pickup of about nine on the quick slant, but credit Shafino for keeping him short of the first down. LaFoon, play action. Rolling this way, throws underneath and pass. Complete with Featherstone. Will drop Morasti as soon as he catches the football. Defense holds, the Indians will take over with 7.15 to go. Ball at their own 25 yard line. Right 
right here. 25, Raekwon Cooper. Cooper will pick up pick about four. Kisner keeps it himself, moves the pile ahead for a first down. Picked up about eight yards. Quarterback number three, Billy Kisner, the ball carrier, out of the 35 to about the 38 yard line, kept at the 37. That's good for Indian first down. Winner of this game gets the winner of the McKeesport Peters Township game. Most likely McKeesport. 47, Chris Stanford, 11, Joan Elizabeth, once again, Wilkie. Your trio, PD Indians up 7 0, a 25 yard fumble return for a touchdown. Isaiah Jones gets a gap to the right side. Isaiah Jones across the 45 to the 46. We'll get about 8 yards. Number 10, Isaiah Jones <laughs> with his first carry of the evening out of the 45. Indians looking at second and a short line. two. Featherstone, Jet this way, has the first down and more. Featherstone will carry the pile with some help from Cameron Richardson down to the 43-yard line. Featherstone That's 11 yards, first down Indians. Trey Reese went out in the last series on the sideline. Let's see if we can see anything. He's on the far side with his helmet off. You know, it's Cody Allen's. Get any kind of word on Trey Reese. Kisner keeps it himself inside the 40 to the 38 yard line, picks up five. Down to about the 39 yard line for a game of about four for Penn Hills. I'll call it four, second down and six. Guzik and Cook, among other PT staffers. Kisner outside, looking for a hole, closes quickly. Kisner wants to get on the quarterback keeper, tries the right hand side for a short game, maybe one or two on the play. 34 Stanelli, 47 Stanford. Make the stop for the Warriors. Third down and four. And Fendel breaks the bottle. Two yards for Kisner, it'll be third down and four. Fake to Jones, fake to Cooper. It's Kisner up the middle, loses the football. He had the first down. Indians turn the ball over to Penn Trafford, who recovered at their own 17 yard line. Should they mark it? No, they mark it at their own 13 yard line. <laughs> well, Trey Reese back out for the Indian defense. Jerome Brown was in there for a few plays. LaFoon in the shotgun. Pistol formation has Stinelli to his left. It'll be Stinelli looking for somewhere to go. Has a gap. Indian stack him up close to the first down marker, picks up close to 10. Now they're going to call to pick up a nine. Buffoon. 
Keeps it himself into the pile, and the Indians stack him up, it appears. Joe Navari and Mike Ames in that center of that line just pushed that surge back. We'll see if he got the first down. Ah, only needed half a yard, and he did get it. From Brown back in the middle there. Ames moves to the outside. LaFoon looks for somewhere to go into the middle. Ames will wrap him up along with Dion Douglas. After he picks up about five. Number four, Devin Austin out of the direct snap. Of there is Devin Austin. That's for a game, what, five or six for Penn Trafford. They went with the Wildcat with Devin Austin back there. Devin Austin stays in. Danelli again, this way. Looks for somewhere to go. Nothing much there. Shafino will make the tackle after pickup of a yard. Tommy Stanelli, the PT ball and that'll be third and about four. Short four. Lafoon throws left side to pass caught. It'll be a first down. Gelsheiser on the coverage. They pick up six. Indian tackler number six, Alex Gelsheiser. Ends flip flop. Thompson comes this side. Aims on the far side. Navari and Brown. The middle of the line, Douglas and Cam Richardson, the linebackers, along with Cody Allen. Dean's playing a 4-3-4. Buffoon under pressure, gets the pass away, and it's caught for a first down. They go after Gelsheiser again. Twenty-four yards on the pickup. Clock under a minute and running. Lafoon on the option. Austin will get wrapped up. Cody Allen. A oh, loss of four, second down and 14. Lead defensive charge for Penn Hill, number 50, Jerome Brown. And number 28, Cody Allen. Marshall Thompson also lending a helping hand for the Penn Hill defense. And the quarter will wind down after one period of play. The score, Penn Hill seven, seven. Penn Trafford nothing. You are watching the Penn Hills Indians Football Network. Second quarter underway, Devin Austin. That's number four, Devin Austin on the left flat from LaFoon. He gets a big block from number 59, Jack Brady. We'll pick up about well, say that name a lot. 10 yards. Devin takes down to the 32 yard line. Says to be third down and three. For the Warriors. 28, Cody Allen. Makes a start for the Indians. Third and short. Stinelli looking for somewhere to go. Trey Reese will wrap him up and drop him for a loss at the 35 yard line. Hey, take it. 
Zanelli will lose three. It'll bring up a fourth and six. Zanelli stacked up in the back room for about a three-yard loss. Leading the defensive charge for Penn Hill's number 88, Trey Reese. Fourth down and six for the Warriors at the Indians' 35-yard line. Fourth down and six. Ben Trafford sends twins to the right. Stinelli will be behind LaFoon. LaFoon looks right the whole time. Throws, pass, batted in the air, and it's picked off by Shafino. Indians would have had better field position, had the ball dropped, but when it's in the air like that, you catch it. You make sure you get the possession. And Shafino did just that. Second turnover of the game for Wood, for Penn Trafford and the Indian offense. And on the interception for Penn Hills is number eight, Austin Freeman. Oh, saying Austin Freeman made the interception. Indians first down and ten. Cooper. Picks up about six. Raquan Cooper. Very entertaining game so far. The 30 yard line for a game of close to six for the Indians. Stanford and Stanelli combined on a stop for Penn Trafford. Featherstone looks for somewhere to go. Does a nice job of slithering his way through Number one, to pick up about seven. And that's a first down for your Penn Hills Indians. Once again, in on the stop for the Warriors is Stanelli and also number 53, Freddie Cook. Jones will go in motion. Left side, looks for somewhere to go. Not a whole heck of a lot. Maybe three. Number 10, Isaiah Jones, up to about the 40 41 yard line for an apparent gain of three. A uh, penalty comes in against the Indians. Illegal shift against the Indians. Kisner picked up about eight on the last play as we're scrambling in the press box here to try to get the coach's camera some power. Jones in motion to the left. It'll be Kisner. Penalty flag comes in. Kisner once again on the quarterback. Keeper. Kisner Don't picks up two. Up Are they marking an offsides against? The no, it's going to be a hold against Penn Hills. So to mark off the 10 yard penalty, the Indians will be looking at a second down and about, about 18. Kisner. Actually, looks like he wants to throw. Steps up, and he'll be sacked. Kisner back to pass. Gooses, first down and 18. Kisner, 
the young sophomore held on to the football, but he's got to learn when to get rid of that football. Get outside the tackles and throw it away. But nonetheless, now a third down and about 24. Clock at 8.45 and running here in the first half. 7-0 Penn Hills. Difference in the game. Malik Russell, 25-yard fumble return for a touchdown. Indians break the huddle with a third down and 24. Twins to the left. Jones in the slot. Comes this way. Kisner throws left side for Featherstone. Trying to set up the wide receiver screen. Gets across the 30 to the 33-yard line. Gets nine. On the left flat. And the Indians will send the punting unit on. Burke, Wilkie, Fourth and about 14. Wrap up Featherstone. Featherstone picked up about 10 yards on the play. Jones will drop back to punt. High snap over his head. Jones should just take the safety. Nope. Loses it. Touchdown. Ben Trafford. To the Warriors, an extra point from tying it. Two defensive touchdowns in the game. Kick is up and good, 7.52. To go here in the first half, new game. We are knotted at 7, Penn Hills, Penn Trafford. You're watching the Penn Hills Indians Football Network. Penn Trafford to kick off. Squib kick, Indians look out of bounds. Nope, won't go that far. Picked up by Mathis, looking for somewhere to go. Mathis has a little bit of a lane. Nice return out to the 39. Indians with good field position. That's up back number seven, Malik Russell on the return. Picking us off the 39 yard line for Pat Trafford. That's number 55, Lance Burke. Ten Hills, first down and ten. Jones for about four. Number ten, Isaiah Jones. Give me ball here out of the 40 to the 42. Let's give him a gain of three on the play. Wilkie, Macaron, Goose, among other Warrior tacklers. Kisner keeps it himself. Left side, close to the first down. It'll be about a yard short. Number three, Billy Kisner on the carry out of the 45 to about the 40. Third, third and down at about one for the a yard. Game. Maybe less than a yard. Making a nice stick for the Warriors is number six, Zach Queen. Penn Hills brings the huddle with a third down and one at their own 48. Clock approaching six and a half and running. Kisner will have the first down and more. Kisner in Penn Trafford territory to the 44 yard line. Quarterback Kisner once again finds some running room straight up the Eight yards for Billy and a first down. For Penn Hills first down. Tied at seven, two defensive touchdowns in this game. For the 